Hello, today I'm going to discuss another possible reason why your relief valve is blowing off in your furnace. Um, this is an extra all tank here. It's uh, green, some of them are blue, red, orange, a number of different colors. Anyway, they, uh, they cushion the water and as the uh, water is being heated, it has to expand. There's a diaphragm inside the tank. And they're usually found on the bottom of the air scoops. Um, so, if by chance your pressure has gone up in your furnace, and you can check that quite easily, there's the relief valve in this furnace, but there's a traticator, and what that does, it measures the pressure on the top, right here, and the temperature on the bottom. So the operating pressure, when the water is heated, should be around 20 pounds. Um, if it's creeping up there, you get 27, 28 pounds, it might be time to find the reason why. Um, there's a relief valve, and that's what you're going to see blowing off. That blows off at 30 psi, 30 pounds. And if you have an extra tank on your system, you are going to have to replace it. So you're going to go to your feed water valve. Looks like this has a little lever on top, and you're going to find the shut off before it. You're going to turn the water off. You're going to go to the drain, which happens to be located in the back of this furnace, right there. You're going to drain that, put a hose on it, drain it off. Your pressure is going to drop down to zero pounds. So here's a traticator here and that's what you're going to see zero psi on the top once you have that you're going to shut your hose off unscrew your extol tank and it's going to be fairly heavy it's going to weigh around 30 pounds so be prepared when you unscrew it you're going to teflon the new one up screw it back in and then turn your water back on and that will relieve your problem if your extra tank is gone. Thanks. Have a great day.